Back off, guys. Back off. I'm here. And I'm rough and tough. This is so neat. Yeah! Just look at that. What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome! Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Vault! That's right, we're playing here with Mega Myth Modded, having so much fun doing flips! Man, oh man! Guys, how you doing today? Hope you're doing good. Me, I'm doing amazing because I got a big old smile on my face. I remembered we made this epic and awesome Viking armor. It is so incredibly cool. Yes, in my hand, it is just a hatchet. But yeah, this super cool skin. Oh my goodness, makes it look like a really crazy awesome Viking tool. Axe, it's super cool. And then we've got all this awesome fur armor. It's pretty sweet. I feel like it's kind of fitting and is all part of the uh, Viking mod. So pretty sweet. I like it. Anyway, uh, going on today, we got to battle the dragon yet again because I don't know. It glitched out. Something goofy happened and we didn't get rewarded with uh, the trophy. So we're going to have to do that again today. I already grinded out all the resources for it. So yeah, it should be pretty easy. We should be able to pretty much just take on the fight. Um, other things going on. The server did finally reset. Yes, a, uh, a mod had an update, and you know what that means. If you don't know, um, yes, we had a Dragon King that we had tamed. It was such a high level that uh, in Ark, unfortunately, it gets reset. It was so high, it got reset, and... Oh, let's find out what is the damage on this bad boy now. I just, I don't know what it's going to be. It was hitting for almost 100,000. So, Lava Island. All right, hopefully this, hopefully it's not too bad. Let's go pop over here. We need to clear out anyway, because we just, you know, being a server uh, reset, we get a dino wipe. And um, we got to see what's going on around here. All right, all right. We've got we've got somebody. Come here, bro. Bro. Oh my goodness. All right, we got an arc demon. Dude, are you gonna get caught on stupid little rocks too? Driving me nuts. All right, here we go. What was it? So it was just shy of hundred thousand. Now thirty six. Okay, okay. That's not horrible. That is not the worst thing in the world. It's getting various di different numbers, but. All right, but it's no longer. I, I can tell you right now, there's not a chance that it is going to be good enough to take on the uh, Mana Reaper Empress anymore. So we're going to have to find ourselves a new Dragon King. Unfortunately, they are extremely rare. So maybe if we clear out enough today, we'll be able to find one. All right, come on, bro. Do, do your big move. Do your big move. And, and waiting for that cooldown. All right, cooldown's too long. Forget it. All right. First kill of the day. Not bad. Um, It's still one of our most powerful creatures. I'll put that out there. Now, we also had, like, what, 6 million health? We are now down to 1.5 million, which is, again, still phenomenal. But it's just not where it was. So, you know, keeping that in mind. What is this? Oh! Armadron. That's kind of interesting. I got to read how to tame this guy again. It's a really strange taming mechanic, but I don't know. That could be something of possibility. It's no Dragon King, but definitely something I had on my bucket list of things I wanted to tame before ending the season. So, all right, something to think about. I don't know. What do you think, guys? Oh, and by the way, before I forget, please remember, if you're enjoying the season, to show that amazing support by slamming that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, seriously, what are you waiting for? It is the perfect time to subscribe. All right, so and that's a pretty good level one too. We'll, we'll just leave that guy alone for now, for now. We'll come back and check him out. Let's, let's finish clearing. All right, beautiful. What do we got over here? Yeah, don't want them getting involved with him. It's kind of a bad spot to tame him. I'll be honest with you. Not not an ideal place. All right, come on. Clearing, clearing. 
Let's go all the way down the beach. And then I'll probably loop around the other side. It's just all around this uh, this den. The wyvern den is where you see the most spawns. All right, cool. Ooh, did you hear that, guys? Little spikes. All right, doing good. Anyway, I'm going to finish up doing this. If I see something cool, I'll come back and show you. But uh, otherwise, we can carry on with business for the day. All right, just about finished clearing. Uh, we do got a Balrog. Let's see if we can be lucky enough to get his core. Oh, we got another Balrog core, finally. Oh, I've been waiting for that. I have been waiting for that. All right, so that means we can get a Balrog today if we wanted, or I could save it back for later. Balrog's one of the stronger creatures, too. All right, last little bit. Let's just go right over here, take a peek in the cave. Not seeing other than the Balrog, no other uh, elementals other than the birds. All right, anything else? No, nothing today, jeez. This is right after a server wipe, too. Usually you see quite a few things. All right. Carrying on. Uh, I'm going to look into about taming for that guy. What does that actually entail? Is it going to be a pain in the butt or not? I know it's a passive tame of sorts. So let's uh, let's take a peek into it. All right, we're back, and I just finished looking up how we tame this super cool dragon, and it's such a neat taming mechanic. Um, its preferred food is actually uh, element ore, which it's been forever since I've like actively looked for element ore. It's generally such a garbage resource when you can get, you know, full elements and shards, um, you know, on this map from harvesting. So I've been trying to rack my brain on where, where have I seen it? Um, I think there's some in the Abyssal Depth, so I think we're going to head on over there. There might be some in some other caves as well, but I went to a couple of them, and I, I just couldn't find it. Yep, right around here. Let's plop down. There it is, the Wyvern shenanigans. And there's our hole into the Abyssal Depths. All right, making my way. Next, I believe we're going to be looking for... Looks kind of like a lava... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right here. Right here. Perfect. All right. Let's just uh, take care of these guys real quick. And then we should be able to hop off. Look at you. You look like a baby Mosa after seeing that alpha right next to him. All right. Yep. Alpha. Ooh. Is that an alpha squid too? Hold on. Let's turn around. All right. That's a normal two, so. Man, that Mosa is huge. All right, beautiful. Thankfully, it's a low level one. All right, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, we go in. Oh, stupid squid ink. I can't see nothing. The worst ability in all of Ark, the dialo venom. <laughs> all right, let's go see what we got. It looks like that might be some. Oh, why can I not move? All right, we good? We good? All right, looks like. You're not element or you're... Ooh, look at that. Dude, this gives so many good resources down here. All right, there we go. This should be element or right here. Awesome. This is exactly what we need. And I might set up a, uh, a seed for one of these. I'm not... There's not like that many uh, other things that require it. You know, like if you're trying to get element the first time or something like that, use it to make element, but we can already get straight element. So, all right, let's just grab a few more so I don't have to come down here again. You know, maybe a teleporter out here wouldn't be a bad idea. Let's do it like right over here. Let's see if I can set one. Um, teleporter. Yes. It's fighting with something over here. Oh no. Oh, it's fighting with a... Oh, crap. It's fighting with this dude. I can't see what this dude's health is. Oh, it's not looking good for him. Ooh, look at that move. I can't even pick up the uh, hitbox on that guy. 
Um, we got to we got to handle it though. We got to take care of this quick. Oh god, not looking good. Oh, I think I. Stupid Goliath! Um, oh, I think I can net the Goliath. Oh, if I can find my stupid net! Okay, Goliath's done. Oh, thank goodness. I hope the Goliath's done. I don't know. It looked like it ragdolled. Either way, that bought him some time. Okay. Not good that I shot him. All right, let's get away. Let's let him reset a little bit. I have to uh, get rid of my mount anyway. Come on. Oh, I forgot that he could fly. That's not good. Oh, that might have messed a lot up. That might have messed a lot up. Oh, crap. All right. Um, and I also realized I don't have my health potions. So you know what? I got to teleport out of here anyway. Hopefully that will lose the aggro. Oh, man. Oh, man. Ooh, let me get my health potions and everything, and then we'll come on back in. Oh, rip. All right. That was a dumb, dumb thing that I did. That was a dumb, dumb thing. All right. He's gone. It's nothing I could do. Uh, by leaving the area... I allowed new things to spawn. All right, there's a possibility there's more around the server than just that one. Do not know. We'll, oh God, we'll just have to find out. Stupid demon, dude. Don't do this to me. All right, come on, come on, come on. Let me ride you. Oh, hurry up, ride. All right, demon. Demon, I'm gonna get you. Oh, God. Not again. Come on. Let me on. I really don't like how it doesn't tell you uh, how long the uh, can't ride thing is for in a buff. It's really frustrating. All right. Come on. Uh, well, maybe on the bright side, we'll actually get another Dragon King to spawn in with how quickly this beach is getting repopulated. Come on! Almost there! All right. Whew. All right, let's just peek. Anything else over here? Um, I did find another Balrog, and I got yet another core, too. I didn't bother showing it because it was so quick, but it's uh, things are looking up for us today. You know we're getting a lot of things going wrong. Things are starting to look up. All right, here we go. Everlast Rallying. Look at them fighting together. All right, come on. Get another core. Get another core. And... Got it! Nice! All right! And Lich time! Let's go! Get all those minions. Yeah, we are wrecking the Lich with this. All right, we still have the Rider protection to some extent. Electricity move, that helps so much. I still don't know if we can ever get a, uh, a Dermis for a Lich. I've been wanting it so bad. All right, cleared. You, it's hit fall. Ha ha, guys, I found another one. Oh my lordy. And I think it's an even better level. Really weird levels. I don't even know. Um. All right, so let's do this. So apparently, I've never done this before, but apparently what you do is you go, and I just want to confirm this. That it's not okay. These can't even go on your hot bar. All right, fair enough. So let's go ahead and let's get those moved. I'm getting these separated basically because you want to drop them on the ground in front of them, sort of like that. You just press O 
and it's going to, I guess, get into like a fighting stance or something. I don't know. We'll find out about this. So we go up. All right. All right. Drop it on the ground. And I think we back off. Okay. And then he's interested in it. All right. He grabbed it. Look at that. All right. And I don't know if we wait until it says it's hungry again. I think we might. Oh, oh, doesn't like it. All right, getting upset. So I don't know. I don't know how this works. Do we wait until it says like it's hungry again? All right, we might have got too close there. I think we got too close. Backing off. Oh yeah, too close. All right, all right. I don't see the tame going up. So you got to stay like at a certain distance of it. We've got tons of this, so I'm kind of just going ham with it just in case. But we probably... Oh. Oh. All right. Yep. I'm, 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 I'm backing off, bro. I'm backing off. This is so neat. All right, and I, I'm I'm pretty sure we just have to stay at this certain distance from it and just chill until I guess it says it's hungry again. Isn't that neat though? Like he doesn't, he's just like saying like, back off, back off guys, back off. I'm here and I'm rough and tough. I haven't seen him eat again, so I'm going to assume, I'm going to assume that means we got to wait until he's hungry again. Yeah, it doesn't look like he's eating the packages. Whoa. Whoa, backing off, bro. I'm backing off. Yelp, yelp. I'm pretty sure this is how we do it. And then once we get up to like 30%, he'll uh, he'll chill out. He'll be like friendly to us. All right, finally, 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 it just ate up and we are above 30%. And now, as you can see, it likes us. It's, it's not doing anything like nasty to us. And I believe we can just chill with it. So it still definitely takes him a little bit of time. Come on, buddy. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, so getting to that 30%, um, I actually messed it up once. I had my tech gloves on and I was trying to like, you know, right click to jump away. And uh, it didn't like that. This guy is a huge hitbox. Like I was way far away from him and it still counted as a hit. So then I had to wait for him to calm down and then completely start the process over from scratch. But this one, such an awesome level, I had to do it. All right, I just hit 80 something percent, which supposedly the dragon now welcomes us, which is pretty cool. Um, I found, I don't know if this is actually the case, but I've noticed it eats a little bit faster if you back off from it and then like come back up to where it gets the dialogue like again and again. I don't know. It, it, like because I've not seen his food go down at all. And it seems like that's the only like interaction that makes him like change or maybe even reminds him to feed. All right. So the dragon welcomes me. Let's go ahead, toss that, and then back off. And it kind of, see? It's like going into the animations to want to eat more often. And I've been doing this for a long time. Probably about an hour now. So, let's see. So now that gives that interaction. Let's drop it and then back off a little bit. Let's just see. Will he do it? He doesn't always do it. You want to give him time. But I have also seen him eat on occasion... I was actually going to cut in before it went to the 80% and uh, he ended up eating something. All right, 93.9. This should be the final feeding when he actually eats. It might take a little while. He just took the previous bite. Come on, dude. Just just eat for the... Yes! 
We did it! This has taken me all afternoon, but wow, we finally have got it. Armadron. All right, we need a saddle to be able to ride him. So let's go ahead, scoop him up. Beautiful! Wow, I'm just gonna leave all that junk there. Okay, let me, uh, that's quite the level two. Let me uh, go see where the saddle is for this bad boy. Um, most of them um, have been, yep, there it is, right in my inventory. Not bad, let's go get it. All right, did my blueprint trick. We've got ourselves a ramshackle blueprint that is maxed out. Beautiful. All right. Um, not sure if you can really color this that much. Um, I guess we could take a peek real quick. We'll do a quick coloring. All right, let's grab you, you, and you. All right, let's see here. So, saddle. All right, it's kind of like a Carno saddle, the coloring of it anyway. All right, what is that? Don't know. All right, we'll go purple. All right, why not? We'll do purple and red. All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Go ahead, toss that back in. And come here, buddy. Wow, it almost looks, it's got kind of like a fox face or, I don't know, it's really cool looking. All right, let's go ahead, scoop you. Let's fly on out of here. All right, cool. And this guy has a plethora of moves, a lot of them. So I think it should be pretty cool. Now, it is not from Pyria, it's from the Grand Hunt mod, which is, whoa! Which is the same mod that the pure Totokaj is from, the Ducky Source is from. Yeah, and it hits for up just shy of a thousand, which is not bad. All right, there's its fly, using, of course, Spacebar to do so. Cool animations. It almost gets like a little bit of like a spurt forward. All right. It's got, that's its normal walk. It does have a sprint. Oh, that's cool. How it goes on like all fours. And the head actually gets really down low. Interesting. Okay. Let's see. Other moves. We have the bite. We have the right click as a fire breath. Pretty good fire. We have C. Whoa! Interesting. Okay. We have axe. Let's wait for that fire to go away. Jeez, that fire lasts a long time. That's a real long time. All right, axe. I think that's a tail swipe, kind of. Okay. Then it has alt axe. Oh, no, that is the alt axe. Let's do C. All right, that's just a swipe with the hand. The normal X is the tail swipe. Then these other moves was the alt and X and alt and C. Okay. Got you. All right. And then left control. Whoa, that's that big move. All right, cool. Um, I think that's all the moves. I think, I think. All right. Um, not bad. I like, look at how it has almost like, it looks like a mask over the eyes. Really, really interesting look to it. It's cool. All right. Um, stat wise, 58,000. It's not bad. Uh, decent carry weight. We can boost movement speed, which we'll likely want to. Um, just before I boost any of the other stats, I'm kind of curious what baseline we're looking at. Let's go, uh, let's go try some of the other moves. So we saw the bite at first. That was only doing like, it was just shy of a thousand, which is pretty good. All right, the flame breath. Okay. Let's try again. Let's do the big move. It's likely going to be the alt C. And, oh, 2000, baby. Not bad. All right, let's do the little tail thing. Okay, nice. Good knock back there. Uh, let's try the claw, which hopefully this guy isn't mate boosted. Okay. Does that, by the way, harvest stuff? Ooh, it gets both metal and wood and all that stuff. All right. Does, does the axe do that too? No, that harvests meat though. 
All right, and then Alt X. Okay, and Alt C. That's really cool. Look at that. It does big flame damage as well. All right. No, this is a pretty cool creature. Definitely not an, like total end game, but it's pretty cool. Um, it's definitely one of the more annoying ones to do. However, you can do well. I think you have to be level 80 to tame this guy. That's that's another catch. We're so far beyond that, but I believe you have to be at least level 80. So I guess it's not. I guess it's it's kind of a late game creature by at least normal arc standards. For us, it seems about the same as like a Dralian, but you know, some cooler move options and looks. I like it. All right, I wonder what's gonna happen in the water. The stances though are just amazing looking. And look at, that's the O. Is there any other weird button ones? Ooh. That move, yeah. Yeah, it's neat. It is really neat. I like him. I think it is super cool, and I'm glad to add him to the collection. Um, let's see how high it can get. And I'm curious, do you have a gender? It do Whoa, it does have a gender. So potentially we could breed him and make him even better. So that's kind of cool. This, by the way, is a creature people have been telling me I need to check out. That's kind of a crap level one, but we'll get around to it. Kind of, it has a spino head. I don't know. It's interesting. I think it's supposed to be good at harvesting uh, something in particular. Maybe maybe it's the, uh, the, the jellyfish. All right. Anyway, let's continue on. All right, guys. We are at max attack in uh, one, two, three, four, and five. Beautiful. Still got a lot more levels to go. Um, I took on... Uh, one of the dark mana guys and it just absolutely gave me like 150 levels it was crazy um looks like our bite now at max on this one anyway we're hitting for come on i know you can hit for more than that bro come on let's get somebody who doesn't resist 440 4400 almost 4500 so that's not bad fire breath all right 2000 very cool. Let's try the big move. Come on over here, bro. All right, you ready for this? I think this is its biggest move. And boom, 12,000. Not bad. Oh, and I found another new move this guy has too. Um, It is shift C. Oh, oh, that was something else new. All right, that's weird. Shift X. All right, come here. Shift X. It spins completely around, and then apparently Shift C does, like, a lunge forward. Let's try this on this guy again. All right, that hits pretty good damage, too. I don't know. All in all, this guy is really cool. I'm not, like, super proficient against, uh, you know, using the controls on him, but it's not bad. And then in the air, that kind of looks like a grab. Let's see. Just trying to cut. Okay. The control works while you're in the air. Whoa. And look at that. Huh. That's pretty cool. We can do the fire breath in the air. Um, let's see. Other moves. The roar while in the air. Yeah. It's not bad. It is not bad. The alt moves don't work. But yeah. It's it's a neat creature. Um, Definitely could see possibly wanting movement speed increased on this guy. But at the same time, it depends what we want to use it for. Um, it gets pretty good health gains, though. So I'm probably going to go up to at least 100,000 before working on any movement speed. But yeah, I'm pretty pleased. Uh, why don't we take this guy real quick while we finish leveling him? Let's just see uh, what's going on over here. If we've got anything else new to spawn. And uh, depending on time, maybe we'll go finish that dragon fight. I think that would be pretty epic. All right, I just about finished doing a uh, run through of this area. I'm not seeing any new like crazy bosses. I'm not seeing any dragon kings. Um, I think we'll just have to call it here. 
and uh, we'll say we'll save the dragon fight for next episode. I, I took a peek at the time. This took so long to tame. Um, I definitely think if I had to tame it again, I, I know a few more tricks on it to make it go faster. Oh, my goodness. Did I crash? What the crap? That was like cave lag. Holy crap. All right. So my game crashed. Well, it didn't actually crash. It just like froze. It was totally frozen. I think it was because we got too close to the cave. I really do not know. Come on, buddy. Come here. All right. Let's get back up to him. It's got a kind of weird hitbox for riding in. There we go. All right. So what was I saying again? Holy crud. I think we did pretty good today, guys. I'm really happy that we finally tamed this beast. It is so incredibly cool looking. Yeah, just look at that. And uh, we'll pick up and I guess redo the uh, the dragon fight tomorrow. There's no rush for today because there is no dragon kings that are showing up. So hopefully tomorrow we get more lucky with that. What is this guy? Look at that basilisk. Hey, buddy. But anyway, let's get back to the base and let me go through those comments. All right, guys, I just finished going through the comments and yes, it is now that time. That's right. Time to name the dinos. For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, I go through the comments of the previous episode and I pick out all the most awesomest name suggestions that you guys leave in the down there. That's right. Just remember, if you want to have a chance of getting your name chosen, you got to be a subscriber. So smash that subscribe button and yeah, just comment down below it is just that easy anyway for today we have our frozen brute wyvern to name and overwhelmingly the most asked for name was none other than frostbite i can't but we almost always have a frostbite every season and i almost thought we had one this season but i couldn't find anything that had it so you got it buddy you got it you are now frostbite yeah, very, very cool. Um, For next episode, we got to name this epic new dragon-like creature. It is so cool. It takes up like the entire space of my base. Quite the presence, but I love it. Oh, but on that note, guys, thank you oh so much for watching. It's been a pleasure. As always, show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, you haven't yet, please do not forget to subscribe for the Daily Arc Awesomeness. And as always, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks again and peace. Ow!